Hey guys, so it's a it's a new day and um, and it started pretty well so far. I had a Bissell Demon task, unfortunately, nothing came with that. But I got lots of key halves, loops, and teeth, and and yeah, just loads of key halves. Um, and now here I am at um, at Steel's. I got a far more reasonable task of forty and um, and a dragon plate skirt. So uh, so my first good decent drop from uh from Steel Dragons. I know they're not actually worth that much, and my God, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? That's supposed to be a plate skirt. I'm dropping them so I can have a good look at them. I can see that it has a sort of skirt bit and... My God. um, That is terrible. That looks terrible. I'm going to wear it as well. Yeah. No, that is terrible. <laughs> uh, it, it very... It, <laughs> I can see where they've gone with it, but it's not an outright skirt like you'd expect it to be, and I don't know why they've they've changed it to look like that. Um, that is a shame, but um, but yeah. So I've got a I've got a plate skirt from the trip. Also, after making that video yesterday where I showed you my current tab and um showed you my my you know my my old tab, um, I couldn't help but want a little bit more of my tab. I couldn't help. But look at all the bones that I had and look at all the Dagonoth hides and, and the Berserk rings and all of that. And I couldn't help but feel that I wanted that to happen again. So I'm going to I'm going to try and use my yak. I mean from for now you, you must go, you must know that uh that when I play RuneScape I try to do it in the laziest way possible. I, I try to make everything just that little bit easier. I try to take as many actions out of out of the the routine um away from you know away from what i need to do and um and one of those one of those actions is constantly having to to send you know pick up bones firstly and then send them away but um but yeah i can't help but look at that tab and want something more than uh than what what my tab will continue to be like i mean so i mean Continuing on the path that I am on now, I mean, we're going to have lots of herbs, lots of seeds, lots of rune items, um, the whips, the dark bows, they'll eventually get there as well, but, um, but what made a considerable amount of that, that, that Slayer Tab's value was the fact that I had all these Dagonoth bones, I had all these, all these hides, I had so much in terms of just, you know, in terms of bones and how much they were worth and how much they're still worth. I don't know if I've made much sense at all, but um, but yeah, I think I think I'm going to start picking up bones, and I might consider picking up ashes as well. I mean, that'll be a that'll be a big task though, because it just it makes the abyssal demon task so much longer, and I don't know, I don't know if I'm up to that yet, but I will consider it, and I'll consider doing necrols as well with Melee so I can pick up the ashes there as well. Um. You know, this is the. I'm. I'm just saying it. I don't know if I'll actually do it or not. Maybe sometimes I'll just say to myself, you know what? I, I don't feel like doing it like this. It will slow me down. It will require a little more attention to the game. And yeah, sometimes I'll want to pay less attention to the game. Kind of like right now because I'm trying to watch a movie called Moneyball, and yet at the same time I'm gonna have to be picking up these bones. So um, hopefully I'll be able to to do both. But um, but yeah, I've only got forty of these to kill, so at least it's not too much work. Um, and also, now, this is one thing that I didn't know, and I guess it must have been a recent update, because I don't remember it ever being the case, but then again, maybe it has been. But, uh, yeah, I didn't know I didn't have to right-click and, and click store on my yak. Um, I didn't realise that, well, when, it, when I can actually see it, I didn't realise I could just use an item with the yak, go straight into the yak, and I can continue killing. I don't believe I, use, I lose a, a tick of, of attack damage, though it did kind of seem that way just now. Um, let me quickly pot up again just before I get burnt to a crisp and die. I die here so often because I forget to use the anti-fire. I should just use a dragon fire shield, but the loss of a dragon defender is far too much for me to handle. Um, so let's see, can I find my yak? Yes, okay, store it. He goes down. No, wait, what? Oh, right, no, sorry. Yeah, I didn't want to store it. I wanted to actually just use it on the yak. I can't really do that, can I? Oh, there it is, okay. So yeah, 80 damage... Yeah, no, you don't lose an attack turn. I think I, I did lose an attack turn just a second ago, but I think that's because of bad timing. 
but um but as long as you time it right it doesn't look like you lose a tick so um so yeah i like that i like that feature i don't know if it's always been there or not it's certainly not something i discovered until very recently when i saw someone in the middle of combat bending down towards their familiar and i thought hold on a minute what what did he just do there how can he store in it, something in his yak without without you know not being in combat anyway i'm gonna let you go now um hopefully i'll get something else from this trip but um but yeah i'm going to do my best to pick up items that's my first rune two-hander so that's going to be another slot in the drops tab but yeah see you in a bit hey guys so i'm still here at steel dragons still haven't killed my quota of 40 in fact it hasn't been too long since i ended the uh, the last clip but there we go starved effigy i always consider that a, a lovely lucky drop a rare drop whatever you want to call it um, but yeah, I love getting those kind of drops, so uh, so hopefully there's a couple more to come from this one, we'll see. Hey guys, so uh, I thought this was quite funny, I was at Castle Wars making uh, gifts for um, for a guide that we're going to be putting on Zaffa, and uh, and I was in this room and I see all these guys without wearing any, you know, any gear and you're thinking, yeah, they're leechers, and normally they're like level 50, level 3, level 10, whatever, just trying to get Castle War tickets, and then have a look at these levels, 138, 138. 100 lots of 138 there got a couple here as well <laughs> and uh, i know exactly why they're afk because obviously they want to get castle war games underway while uh being able to get their trim completions cape but yeah without having to put any effort into it and and to be honest if i was thinking of getting a trimmed completionist cape that's how i would do it i would just be afking here not doing anything at all um but yeah it's it's quite funny how everything has changed recently and how we've gone from having lots and lots of bots, though I guess there weren't too many bots for Castle Wars because there's not much to gain. Um, so I guess they were all relatively decent levels, but but now they're all 138, and you know that they're all you know they're all people that probably have completionist capes that are that need to uh, that need to get their 5k games on Castle Wars done so they can um, get their trimmed completionist capes and get their professional capes for Castle Wars. And um, and yeah, I just I just thought it was funny how uh, how the role has reversed. Anyway, um, I'm gonna get back to what I was doing.